is up everyone, Mr. Raviator here bringing you another episode of The Sims 4 Family Matters here on Aviator Games and you guys, today is a big day because a new stuff pack pretty much just came out a couple days ago and that stuff pack is called Backyard Stuff. Now you're probably like, Aviator, wait! On Family Matters you don't have a backyard! You have a tiny lot with a giant house! Well hold on guys. Let me show you something. Look at this! I moved the house! There's our old house right over there. And now I moved the exact house over here to a lot that is much bigger. Look at how big this lot is, guys. It is like double the size of our house. Even more than double. So here's what we're doing in today's episode. We're going to build a deck, a huge one, with a giant massive pool, entertainment area, barbecue grills, everything. And as you can see, I did cheat in a little bit of money so we can kind of get things moving before, you know, Carl dies from trying to work his job and I'm pretty sure we're gonna spend most of this money on the backyard anyways we're gonna have slip and slides playgrounds it's just gonna be the most amazing backyard you've ever seen but guys before we get into this episode don't forget to show that like button some love by smacking the crap out of it that like button likes tough love <laughs> it likes really tough love so make sure you smack the crap out of it let's go for over a thousand smacks if we get over a thousand smacks I'll upload another Sims 4 video tomorrow Yes, I'm holding the videos hostage. I'm an evil YouTuber <laughs> that just, I can't be stopped. I, I'm, I'm serious. You cannot stop me. I control the uploads. <laughs> okay, so I'm trying to fix this grass here a little bit just because it was kind of patchy at the last house. I'm going to still add the detail, but I just want it to look like one nice smooth uh, piece of grass without any potholes or anything like that. And then we can always go here and, you know, get the little circle here and just Okay, so just add the little flowers, you know, because it, it just makes it look so pretty. Um, and then I think I'll add a wee bit more. There we go. Looking beautiful. Looking gorgeous. Now we can move on to the backyard, the main attraction. We're going to change the time of day, though. I want to feel like it's daytime. It's the afternoon. So this is what our house will look like during the day kind of depressing but I think the living room is going to have our patio doors because it's going to work out perfect it's, it's going to be beautiful so let's get our living room to have some patio doors in it and that's how we're going to get in and out of the house uh patio doors though nothing like weird and no weird doors these are kitchen doors where's the patio doors these are like spa doors these aren't bad uh, how tall is this door this is this door I think is too tall oh is, is it because it's got nothing to hang off of do I have to build the deck first do I have to build the deck first? I'll build the deck first. Okay, so let's decide how we're going to build this deck. I think we're going to connect it here, obviously. And then we're going to go outwards like this. And then the deck's going to wrap around the whole back of the house. No, it's going to just wrap to like the center point here. Okay, and then we're going to have a pool off of this deck here. And then this will be playground areas and all this good stuff. And I think we'll make the deck a little bit wider because I kind of want room. Actually, we'll make the deck so we can put a pool inside of it. And then have lounge chairs around it and everything. I think this is a really good sized deck here. Uh, let's click off of it. So yeah, I think you know we can put a pool over here in this corner. And then we can have like grills and loungers all over the place. It'll be beautiful. Okay, so let's design the pool next, I uh, guess. Uh, so pool tool. <laughs> That's what we need. Uh, wait, custom pool tool. What can we do with this? Can we? Oh, we can do any angle we want. I don't care. I don't need a fancy pool. Right now, guys, I'm not trying to get all fancy here with my pools. My pool skills don't have to be like that. So let's just pull on this pool like this. And then we're going to... Uh, I don't know how wide I really want this. We might have to make this deck a little bit wider. I'm just going to have to see. But actually, actually, that's a pretty decent sized pool. We can still have chairs and everything. And it's going to be pretty beautiful. It's going to be fun. Okay, so now what do we want to do? Probably... Oh my god, are these new? Swimming sparkles. Like, look at this. Ew! Okay. Okay, that's nice. No, that's like... Oh, that's like mud. <laughs> oh, God! Okay, okay, hold on. I like this one the best. Okay, so boom, we're gonna put that in. I didn't know that was a thing. Wild rock. Does this come in different colors? It does. Okay, so we can go like something like this around the outside. I like that. Looks really nice. Multicolored pool trim. No, we don't need that. Okay, so what else is there? There's little tiny accent pieces. Oh, this is so cool! Okay, so we can have, like, a ladder here, and then we can have another ladder here, right? That looks about even. So they can get in and out there. Now, is there some type of diving board? A jump and splash. Okay, so this is going to be perfect. So let's go like this. Oh, it's two. We could put one here. You know, this is just going to be a beautiful pool, guys. 
The bubbles crack. Oh, this is going to make awesome, like, bubbles come out of there and stuff. That's going to be fun. Okay, so... But won't they just drown? <laughs> they'll be like, bubbles! And then they'll be down there drowning. I don't know if we want that. I don't know if we want our Sims down there drowning. I'm not saying our kids are stupid or anything, but, you know, things happen once in a while. Okay, so let me see. What else can we do? What is this? What is this? Lap guides? What's the... Oh, oh, lap guides. Wait, what? Oh, I see. Oh, I see. For swimming laps. Now, we don't need anything like that. Oh, this is illuminated, guys. Hold on now. That's illuminated. That's beautiful. What's this? The light? Oh, this is light. Pool lights. They're too tall. Like, how, how, do you, how do you have... How do you make such a tall pool? Oh, that's just for, like, the ground or something, I guess? Okay, well, let's get some lights in here. Let's make them, like, this color and this style. Okay, so then we can go kind of like this. And like this. Okay, and that looks pretty nice. Okay, and then let's put a couple more pool lights in the side of the pool. And then just a few out here. And boom. That looks nice. And then let's go like this and like that. Okay, so these are a little uneven. We're going to move these over a little bit. And then we can just slide that like this. Okay, so that should be good. The pool will be nice and illuminated at night. We can put some of these on top of the pool. I think that's disgusting. I don't know why anyone would want that on their pool. Like leaves and stuff. Okay, so that's our pool. It looks really good. Now the deck has to be have some type of flooring. And I don't know. I'm leaning wood. I think I'm definitely leaning wood. Um, how does this look? Ooh, that looks really nice. <laughs> that looks so good. Okay, and then we need like a fencing to go around our deck because we don't want neighbors to come in and try to swim in our pool because why would we let them swim in our pool? That's all I gotta say. Okay, hold on now. Hold on now. One of these have to be, one of these have to match, have to match the aesthetic we're going for. That is not gonna match the aesthetic we're going for. Um... Okay, so that's a, that's the height I want, but not the color I want. Uh, well, actually, this isn't bad, to be honest. This is actually pretty nice. It's kind of like concrete-y and toomey like but yeah, I don't know. I'll see if I, how I feel about it in a little bit. But I, I like this. You know, you got a nice pool, nice walls and everything. I think what we could even do is expand this just a little bit, okay? Like, let's expand this. Let's move the whole pool, the whole kit and caboodle can come over here because then that leaves more room for just like chilling and and swimming and and all sorts of stuff like that and and whatever we want to do like have a barbecue out here um let's see let's go like this there that's that's nicer it's super close super beautiful now let's uh put some lounge chairs out here and and make this happen okay so let's go to our build menu here go to grilling and outdoor stuff now I want some loungers. I want really nice loungers. I feel like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Did they add new backyard stuff? They did, right here. Okay, so this is a new backyard thing. Very nice. What about this one? What colors does this come in? Oh, this is funky. Oh, this one's funky, guys. But we're, we're gonna take the plain Jane one. Okay, we're gonna plop this bad boy over here. So we're gonna we're gonna actually get a couple of these just because then we can have the whole family out here just having a good time in the sun. Uh, we could actually plop them like this. I think that will be nice, like just something like that and like this. Okay, so that would be nice. Put some tables and, or some chairs around them. I think these are new chairs as well. So let's see what kind of chair we want. I want like light materials because we've been using kind of light materials all around. So. Let's try these chairs. I heard these tables, you can put six chairs around them, which is crazy. That pretty much fits our whole family at one, but if we have any type of gathering or party, we're going to need more room. So there we go. Beautiful. Love it. Got to gotta love it. Okay, so now we're going to have to get a grill because grilling out is a thing that everyone likes to do. Uh, let's get like this beautiful silver grill here. Um, and then I think I want to... Oh, $1,500. Okay, hold on now. Is this new? Is this... No, that's with the hot tub stuff. Okay, well, this is still new to me. So we're going to get this bad boy right here. It's, it's beautiful. It's a big, giant grill. Um, then we probably should get some type of counter space to, to hold any type of cooked valuables. Um, let's see. The, the, that, those are so nice, and I can't get them. Okay, so what about these? These kind of came with everything. Um, let's go like this. Something, Just something nice like that. Just like three. Uh, I'll go with the lighter colors like this. I think we might only need two, to be honest. Or maybe we can 
put one like this and just be like boom like look at that it's the little grill master section for the all the grillers in the world okay and then we probably want this is gonna be a great entertaining area um we probably we should actually probably just put these like this you know like just nice and and even with each other are these even are these I think these are even yep they're even okay so let's actually try to maybe space these out one more so there they got a little bit of space between each other we could actually move this oh that's too much there we go so just nice nice little area for sitting um, then we can lay out some chairs here I, I definitely want to have some type of lounging area to lounge in the Sun so where are those lay down chairs like the chairs that you see at the beach or the pool I've seen them before don't you be messing with me chairs don't you be messing I know there's lay down loungers there's got to be lay down lo loungers loungers that's a weird word to say loungers um, I see benches and I see chairs I just don't see the lay down chairs that I want I want lay down chairs okay let me undo I'm gonna undo I'm gonna leave these tables at an angle then if there's not gonna be the lay down chairs I want but I do want these wicker chairs because these chairs are sick we can we can like have a whole setup right here just like a wicker chair setup um, let's grab I know they have a chair version of that couch yes they do okay let's grab this and because then we can literally just we can have like an amazing little sit down area and just you can chill I uh, do they have a table that can have like a fire in it oh that would be amazing is this a coffee table that is not considered a coffee that is not considered good this is not considered a coffee or do they have any coffee tables come on there's got to be outdoor coffee tables I know they have this stone thing and that's kind of a coffee table but it's too bright it's it's not the color I need or want in my life it's, it's more of a rustic color uh, oh right here there we go that's not bad so there we go our outside lounge lounge area our uh, grill area and then we can have a masterful little dining area over here and then what kind of outdoor activities are there to do so here's outdoor activities this is all new so we have the wind chimes which I heard are very pleasant amazing devices so we can put the wind chimes like on a little stand over here even like I'm not gonna put them now but there's there's wind chimes Ooh, look at this this is so awesome so this is for like restaurants and stuff like in California we have these everywhere just because people are so cold all the time uh, so these are actually cool I don't know if we need them in our yard because we're not cold people oh my god look at that we're not gonna use that we could have a hot tub I, I don't know if I'm digging a hot tub though uh, I kind of just dig like this it's very natural what is this a cooler guys this is a cooler hold on now when did the Sims get all practical when did the Sims get all all practical here hold on we can uh, we can put this cooler somewhere you know this is a party this is this is a this is a fun party okay hold on we, we, we can't get so sidetracked can't get distracted guys there's got to be an activity this the gift of fire that is a big fire oh here's one of the new slip and slides oh yeah oh yeah this is this is the life okay my kids are gonna get spoiled guys they're gonna get all the slip and slides even this 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 crappy one okay so let's give them that one let's see what colors these come in so they come in oh this one's cool oh that one's cool too oh my god they're all so cool this one's pretty cool I like this one a lot it's it pops okay so then let's go with this one and get like a reddish purple too do they have the reddish purple the reddish blue they have like a red yellow that one's cool so there we go some slip and slide action you know fantastic outcast is everlasting okay so what else what else do, what else do I want do we have anything else that we could sell oh we got some little desk oh sales award we don't want to sell that that's that's valuable to him okay there's there is lounging chairs guys I am losing my mind I'm losing my mind I'm, I'm out of my mind right now okay so I, I don't think there are there's no lounging chairs okay so let me see hmm I could put a hot tub here if I move these chair this back to where I had it this is such a tough decision guys because this is gonna be such an awesome room and I don't want to have it bad. I want it, I want it to be amazing. I want people to to beg to come over to our house, and be like, "Can we chill?" And then we we're like, "I don't know. We're kind of busy, you know, kids, everybody." Okay, so there we go. This looks really good. This looks like a good time. Okay, is there a buffet table? Is there a buffet? I think there is. We need a very a very relaxed lounging area. There is no buffet table. Wait, I know there's um where is that one like the chocolate fountain dew fountain and all that I know they have all that stuff I know they do 
Is it an activity? Is it considered an activity? <laughs> I don't know if it is. Okay, um... Oh, we could put some activities out here, to be honest. We could have, like, some, you know, nice treadmills or something like that. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just shooting here now. Flaming Tiki Bar. Okay, this is cool. This is cool, guys. Okay, hold on now. Because we could... We could just have the ultimate backyard right now. We could just... <laughs> oh my god, we spent too much money! How much is Tiki Bar? $2,000! How did we spend $35,000 on this? Wow, this backyard is amazing. <laughs> so expensive. I hope the kids like it. How much was this? Sell. 675 That's worth keeping. You know, the kids are going to love it. So let's try to... Um, let's try to see what else we can get for $2,000. That's outdoor friendly for kids. And I know we have the playground systems, which we can't afford any of them. Because they're three grand. We can get uh, monkey bars or something like that. Let the kids play on the monkey bars in the backyard. I do. I so badly want the playground, though. What can we sell? Like, do we need the hot tub? I feel like we do. I feel like... How much is this? $330? Eh. That's, that's, not, that's quite worth it. That's... How much is the cooler? Okay, $275. we will take that back. Okay. What else could we sell here? Uh, the hot tub is not a necessity. But it is nice. There's just options. We have options now to hang out. I think this is good for the backyard. To be honest, I do want to make changes to our basement too. So I think this is going to have to do it for the backyard for now. Just because I don't want to blow all of our budget on the backyard. But I also want to get some flowers out here. Just kind of spruce up the backyard a little bit. So it's just not so plain and green. So let's just kind of go like that. The flowers kind of extend. Actually, how would the whole thing look with like flowers kind of like a dandelion yard here uh do i like that i absolutely do not like that okay let's go <laughs> let's get rid of that all of it all of it get rid 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 of it there we go let's go with like much lighter much mellower vibes like just like oh there oh look at there's little flowers there's flowers everywhere guys just, just a little happy flower and then a little more happy flowers guys Okay, just just like a little little spread, a little infection of flowers. You know, that's that's all we need. Okay, just 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 little happy flowers. Okay, there we go, happy flowers all around. Okay, so they have to actually have to go outside to do the outdoor activities. Eventually, we'll put a gate or something out here. But this is very nice. I think there's a new speaker too. So let's find that. Uh, where did it go? Where did it go? Here we go. So there's a new speaker. It's this one. It's like a futuristic speaker of sorts. Um. Oh, we need a door, don't we? Don't we? I think we need a door out here, guys. Okay, hold on. Let me place this at a decent height, okay? So the kids can't reach it. And then we're going to have to get rid of this painting because we're going to put a door there. Oh, that was a $400 painting. Not bad, not bad. And then we just need doors. Just the patio. I swear there was a double patio door. This, this is not a patio door, but I guess it could work as one. Uh, let me see how that looks there. Yeah, that looks good. That looks pretty good, guys. So here's our brand new outdoor area. The kids are going to love it. The adults are going to love it. It's it's risen our house value tenfold. And our, our house needs some type of work. It needs some type of work. I'm not going to lie. It, the backyard should not be so flat. Just put some big windows here. <laughs> it, it needs something. It needs something for sure. Like, we could put a few windows here. Just to add that character, but I don't think it's necessary. Let's go back. Okay, so, this is our house for now. It's just a giant complex with giant things to do. It, it, it's a family's dream, okay? So, uh, let's go down here into the basement and build that office. We really need the office. You know, Carl needs one. He can't keep working in his kid's bedroom anymore. It's just creepy. Uh, it's not needed. Oh boy, we don't have a lot of money left though. We we blew quite a bit of our budget. Um, but let's let's build a, just a decent office here. Nothing crazy. That was eight hundred dollars. But at least we can get started, and that's all that matters. So let's find some wood paneling. This is new from the kitchen update. Ugh, gross. It looks like kitchen stuff. We can't have that in the office. That would be kind of depressing. Uh, white? No, no, no. What about this? Wait, 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 wait. This is from the party stuff. Oh, that's fun. Okay, so let's get the flooring too. Just something light. Just something beautiful. Just light and happy. 
Um, okay, and then let's get a light down here too, so we can see stuff. That would probably be helpful. Uh, I think, you know, we just need our simple, normal light here. Just like a nice white light right in the center. It's fun. This is like a fun office. It's like a, it's like an advanced, like, futuristic office. Okay, so let's go here. Go to office space. Let's get him a desk, because that's something he'll probably need right off the bat. Yeah, I feel like it doesn't need to be fancy. Doesn't need to be. I don't think it does. I think we can just stick with it pretty simple. Pretty, pretty plain Jane. We'll put him in the corner over here. Ooh, that was expensive. Okay, uh, what else? He needs probably a decent executive chair, so he doesn't want to cry sitting on it all day. Okay, uh, that's 185 bucks. We're getting really low on money again. But, you know, at least we have an office. We should get him a door. <laughs> We can maybe steal one of the kid's computers. I don't know. Let's see. Then he's got he's going to have a seeing glass door, so that way the kids know if he's doing something. You know, if he's if he's working or what before they interrupt him. You know, so that's that's a good plan. Well, yeah, we'll put it right here just so it's in the center of the room kind of. Because then they can look through and be like, is dad working? Is he working? Or is he just playing video games? But yeah, this is our new project room. This is something we're going to be working on down here and trying to make this downstairs like a full functioning part of the house, which I'm excited about. But guys, I think this is where we're going to end today's episode. We got the backyard built. I'm super stoked. I think it's going to be great. I'm going to put some lighting out here probably. And and then I, I'm just I'm so excited. I hope you guys are too. If you are, make sure you smash that like button. And don't forget to comment down below the secret hashtag you see up on the screen right now. That'll allow me to know you made it to the end of the video. But thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, remember to take it easy. Lemon squeezy.